What's up, fishing fam? It's your boy X Marks the Spot, and we back with the messes up video, or AKA verse of the video. Um, and today I'm gonna be going over uh, First Samuel. So in First Samuel, um, that's when Saul. So First Samuel is about David, but before David was appointed king, Saul was appointed king. So um, the day when it happened. Saul and his servant went out looking for his father's goats and um, they went to multiple cities and Saul finally talked to the servant and said, hey, let's let's get back home before dad stops worrying about the goats and starts to worry about us. So um, the servant told him, no, let's try one more city. It's supposed to be a supposed to be a prophet there. Let's go and see if he can tell us where the goats are to make a long story short. They get there and. Saul is appointed to be king over Israel. So um, basically, if Saul would have went back, if the servant wouldn't have said anything and they would have went back to his father, Saul would have never been appointed king. So Saul was in the place he was supposed to be when he was supposed to be there. So that's my whole um, message for this video. Be where you're supposed to be when you're supposed to be there, whether that's work, class, um, Anything, it, it can relate to anything, a grocery store, anything. Uh, you never know who the Lord is using to move in your life, to answer your prayers or for you to answer their prayers. Uh, with that being said, this video or this particular catch, um, I prayed and the Lord told me to go to Hideaway. I prayed for a specific sign and he gave me that time six, like no exaggeration. Um, once I got the first sign, I prayed again and asked him which side to start on. He told me to start on the narrow side. So I ended up not starting on the narrow side. I parked on the opposite side and I saw an alligator in the water. I've never seen an alligator or hideaway. So I walked to the narrow side, I started there. I started fishing. I was maybe fishing for 15 to 20 minutes. I prayed for another sign and the Lord gave me that last sign, which determined which way I would go around the pond. Um, and you gotta watch the video to see what happened. So. Uh, yeah, always, if you're new to the channel, subscribe, um, like and comment on the videos. If you feel like that message is for someone you may know or you feel like that can help them in any way, uh, I just ask that you share the video with them. Um, yeah, and enjoy the video. All right. Got the black and blue chatterbait on the H2OX Lose Xfinity. Uh, this is 20-pound monofilament in here. Next, we have the Six Sense ESP paired with the KVD. I'm gonna be throwing the spinner bait on there. I got a little crawfish trailer on there, something new that I'm trying. And then lastly, we have the custom lose reel on the Ducket Triad, and I'm gonna be throwing the Six Sense wake bait on. There. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Thank you, Jesus. Let's go. Let's go. Slap him. Slap him. Slap him. Let's go. Let's go. I got my skill in my pocket. Let's go, baby.
That was a fight right there. Zeros on the scale. Four seven four. Let's go. Whoo, let's go. Stomach full. Look at her belly. Stomach full. Stomach full. I'm pumped up, y'all. I'm pumped up. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs>